M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So here at the bottom we have the Yesu FT991A, VHF, UHF, 6 meter, all band radio with a built-in tuner and a, a live waterfall scope here with lots of digital modes. Excellent radio, radio, highly recommended, been around a few years now and it just works great, 100 watt radio. Okay, let's turn that one up. Yeah, the filter works good. You've got a, a shortcut menu and a long menu. There's your shortcuts. And then your long menu, like a hundred items. Mode, band. Just around the knob, all backlit white, white backlit buttons, VFO. A to B, A, B, fast lock. It's just the usual clarifier, RF gain volume, CS. And the, the thing that is unusual about this radio is if you go to band, sorry, mode, C4 FM. All modes as well. But if we go to VH, where normally I would say 438575 is my hotspot. If you've never had a hotspot, they look like this. Much You can get them much smaller. You don't have to have a, a nice color screen. But the bottom line is they connect your radio to the internet using, on this radio, it will be C4FM. Or you can, you know, access C4FM using a repeater as well that is C4FM enabled. But that repeater will also be connected to the internet. You can hear it now. And I can use my own repeater for my Isaacs. So it says it says DN there, C4 FM. And yeah, so we are quite now about it. Works great, and then a push of a button. You're on HF. Two buttons. Right, let's have a look at the ICOM 7000. So this is an older radio, it came out around 2004. At the moment I've got it on my all-star node, which is in this house, analog mode. See if it comes to life. And let's, um, f to select different bands, you go up and down here, you've got these. Then you've got your preamp, your mode button, AM, FM, USB, LSB, there, it's not digital ready this one. The 910 is, will do FTA modes, digital modes, out the box. There's someone just talking there. Big menu structure, quick, or settings menu is pushing this button. Look, you've got all these different settings. That's all your settings menus, quite a few. Then you've got your other, your master sort of menus, M1, M2, M3. Hold it, sub menus. Hold it again, you start to go into SWR scope. Band, so this is their band scope, it's not waterfall. You can click hold, and then you can go right and left and select the activity. So it's very usable, a bit like the 756. So that's FM, uh, sounds a lot better with an external speaker. Then push again, look, ALK, COM, SWR. Now you can get all your meters on here as well on the 991. It's got to remember how now. Menu, no, F menu. Then look for meters. Be here somewhere. I mean, look at all the different functions. Power, there's meter. It says ALK, SWR. As you can see, back out. Both really recommended radios. Filter-wise, you've got all these DNR filters built into the shortcut menu. 
you select them then adjust them you can put shortcuts along the bottom for the filters as well and it's got good reputation this radio on the 7000 if you want filters you can just push that and it, they come up look push it again adjust and select your filter menu hold it go to filter there's your filters filter number one at the moment and number two at the moment so as you push it filter three filter one or you can hold it and then you can adjust okay you need to want to, to adjust you need to push this first the little green light comes on then you can start adjusting but we've got no frequency no no signal at the moment to adjust we need to be in hf I will put it on HF. So look, 7160. Let's put the 7000, the icon on 7160. See there. Well, I'm mobiling around now. I'm passing a little industrial or retail estate, McDonald's and Coffee Coffee and all that. 70 SEMS. Back to HF. Let's flip back to the 991. That's it really, just thought I'd just quickly show them. Lots of buttons to push on both radios. Backlit buttons. They don't make the 7000 anymore, which is such a shame. If they had made this QRP, I think it would have been one of the best selling radios ever. The problem was that people complained that the finals couldn't cope with the 100 watts. And we had some problems there. The 991, after the 991 model, they brought out the 991A. Once they got to that model, I think everyone was happy then. So thanks for watching my channel. Catch you on air. Bye for now.